right. We got to say, man, two guys that you probably wouldn't know from doing radio, but what a program you guys do. Of course, Rick Tomasi and Joe Bonazzi join us now. What is Festa Italiana? Am I saying that right, gentlemen? Yes, what is are. that all, right, all yeah. about Sunday mornings? Go ahead, Rick. That's <laughs> <laughs> a buck right there. Yeah. Festa Italiana is an Italian American program that's been in Erie as many years as I can conceivably remember. It started in the middle to late 30s. Mm -hmm. Pat Capabianca's father was was one of the co-founders of the program, and I think a man by the name of John DiLoretto. We've always called it the Italian Hour. It's on from 9 to 12 on Sundays. Yeah. And much more than just an hour, right? Yes. Much more. Because, I mean, there's so many great Italian songs and Italian artists out there. That you can't put that into one hour, Joe. No, no. Yeah, <laughs> we, uh, yeah we play a, a variety of, of, uh, of songs uh, from the uh, you know, Italian heritage. Oh, yeah. Anywhere from, uh, you know, Dean Martin, of course, you know, the Frank Sinatras, the Perry Comos. That's an ongoing debate, correct, on the program. Yes, it, it is. is. Uh, yeah, we may have about? to do a poll. Okay. Because yeah. you guys say that Dino is ahead of Frank Sinatra. He is. Okay, yeah. Yeah. all right. He's no, probably my favorite like also, yeah. Yeah, oh, that yeah. was phenomenal. So what is it if someone turns on, and it's not W-E-R-G, correct, the game station? Yes, yes. If someone turns on, what can they expect to hear? Is there a debate? Is there more music? What's going on there? It just depends upon, you know, uh, Joe and I, we kibitz a lot. The, yeah. uh, Joe Lombo and I are on, we kibitz a lot. You got the beautiful Jeannie Delora. She's with Nate the Great, our, our uh, uh, IT guy. Right. And Gary Grack. Uh, oh, Gary, yeah. Gary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know so, Gary. The Grackmeister. The Grackmeister. Yeah. yeah, everybody has kind of has a nickname. Oh, yeah. that's beautiful. Our, my buddy Kevin DeMarco, he's, nice. uh, he, he fills in for us. Uh, did we did we cover everybody? I think we got everybody, <laughs> yeah. Yep. What, what is it like for you guys when you're on the air and you're, you're playing the music and you're debating? What's that like for you? For me, it brings me back 65 years mm -hmm. when I was a little boy living with my mother and father and my sister. Every Sunday morning, my mother turn that big stereo console yeah. on at 9 a.m. and we'd listen to Italian music until 11.30. We'd pile into the car to drive to St. Luke's. Did you say 65 years ago? My goodness, mm -hmm. Rick. No way. No one's believing that. Are you kidding me? Uh, you're the best. I, I love it. How about, I, I love you. How about for you, Joe? Does it also bring back the <laughs> Same memories? thing, yeah. yeah. When I was a young what, young child, I remember, yeah, my mom, same thing. Sunday mornings, 9 o'clock, radio turns on, sauce is cooking. So it brings back a real lot of memories, and I think it does for a lot of people. You know what? You know? The only thing we're missing here, right, is another Italian. Well, you know, we're, yeah. I mean, there's only oh, one man. reason why Ruse wouldn't be here, and, and he's doing what I, you know, what I expect him to, to do. So, so, yeah. Tell him what his nickname is. Yeah. So we got a problem. You know, we got Tomasi, we got Bonacci, we got Ruzi, and we got Ward. So we got a <laughs> Metagana. <laughs> Uh, among us, so hey, my grandma. We're gonna have Italian. to give you an okay. A bit of, there you yeah, go. There you See, go. you're in. Yeah. You want to toss in. us to break, gentlemen? While you're at it, come on now. We're gonna take a look outside from our bayfront camera. John Salem, big boy. Well, you know, take it, it goes, away, Joe. John. There you go. <laughs> That's coming up when Harry moves on seven. Goes right back. <laughs> 